My name is Daniel Hegarty, Revan Go Off-Road Motorcycle Club, based for young kids around Cockrave and Rushcliffe area in Nottingham. The Go riding in exchange for contracts and good behaviour. I've moved on since Revan Go, worked my way up through the R6 Cup and then potentially I might be doing British Superbikes next year. The whole basis of Love and Go is that the young people have control of what they're doing. We're just a monitoring brief to make sure things run safely. The lads themselves look after it, they know what they're doing and they take care. We do the bikes all ourselves. We have a like, toolbox which is very handy. They've also learned a lot about mechanics and also about personal development stuff, who they are and how they turn out into the world as proper adult people. One thing you'll notice whilst they're here is that they are functioning as trainee adults rather than as teenagers. The way that they're throwing the bikes around here is giving them a good stead in life. It's a learning process with everything that they do. It, it means a lot. The children learn such social skills with being in a group like this. And without things like the Big Lottery Fund, we just couldn't keep it going. Simple things like I'm having conversations at tables, you know, like families should do. They're learning to respect their equipment, rely on one another for uh, maintaining the bikes. It's getting them off the streets and into a nice, secure area where there's adults to keep a check on them. It's keeping me off the streets. Um, really growing up. I enjoy it a lot. We are having more responsibility because it's our group, not anyone else's. I haven't seen that one yet. Is it once you get? My behaviour is getting better and better. It's an easier way to grow up. There's more than one of them, in fact, who have been the subject of severe bullying at school, and they've used this project as their climb out of bullying and learning how to react to that bullying and deal with it without becoming bullies themselves. Now that my daughter's just started it's her first ride today, it's bringing us out more as a family, a family out in sort of thing. What's on your knees? Knee pad. What's on your elbows? Elbow pad. And what are you going to put on your head? Helmet. What's on your hands? Gloves. I'm really looking forward to coming again next week. It was my first day today and I fell off a couple of times, but then I decided to get back on after. When the group first was originated, one of the issues in Cockgrave was significant amounts of illegal riding on mini motos and so on around the street. The crime stats now show a dramatic reduction in that sort of activity. Without Big Lottery Fund, this wouldn't happen today.